All right, so we're reset here to uh, this second three inch clean out here, and this is just over on the left side of the building, right where the uh, wood fence and block wall meet outside this bathroom window here. And from this location, we should be able to hopefully get the rest of the way through the system. And you can see here, this line is only about a foot deep. So it's pretty evident why it's not draining. Alright, so here's where we're connecting from our modern plastic to our clay. Now, what looks kind of like a root there, that's actually just a shaving off the end of the pipe that's sticking in. It should have been ringed out, but it's not a major situation. All right, so now we're inside the original four-inch clay piping. Uh, the uh, original clay piping is a material that is expected to have a long service life. It's a natural material, so it's not expected to deteriorate underground, but it is more brittle in nature and does have a higher potential for damage during seismic activity or earthquakes. Now here we're seeing a, a slight root intrusion at this joint area. This is a fairly common condition in these older clay pipes. Normally we're going to be suggesting that these root intrusions can be maintained with regular sewer line cleanings. It's when they left unmaintained for extended periods that they can create blockages in the system to potentially damage a pipe. What I see there is not of any real concern. And coming up on another area of what we would consider common root intrusion, but uh, getting a little more significant, so definitely in the realm that we would be recommending uh, regular maintenance cleanings annually to maintain these roots. Now, this clean out access provided is undersized, being a three inch uh, and, this, and being a four inch clay pipe. So, we may be suggesting another clean out access somewhere, depending on how far we're going to have to run. So we're running straight up along the uh, left side of the building here towards the front yard. Increasing from our four inch clay pipe to the six inch pipe. It looks like we're going to just run straight out to the public sewer here. More areas of root intrusions and some debris buildup. Try and get these areas free of debris as much as we can, so hopefully we can get a better view. Now you can see how these roots will cause some slow drainage. Commoners that are catching debris and houses.
drywall tape or something in the pipe, so more than likely our recent renovations and the uh, painters and drywall people washing the brushes and trays and whatever down into the sewer system and it's catching on that with the roots. So I'm definitely going to recommend a good thorough cleaning at this point. City connection. Let me get that lens cleaned off a little bit. Uh, unfortunately, now we're just covered with cobwebs. Alright, so uh, I'm going to wrap up the video portion of the examination. I am going to take a look at where the uh, three inch plastic connects up to that four inch clay. We may be best off getting another clean out access there, a full size four inch. But uh, that's pretty much everything we're going to need to see today. So uh, this is Mark Harrison with Sewer Line Check Professionals. Thank you very much. Have a pleasant day.